this is Eric. Um, I, I'm, I want to do an interview of him and the reason I want to do this interview is because Eric is, um, is an ordinary people and then full of happy energies. And every time I saw him, I just feel all my unpleasantness went away. I want to know what's the secret of him, you know, being so satisfied, he seems so satisfied about his life and uh, maybe talk about his long lasting marriage. I'm always curious. You know, how can people maintain a very long-lasting marriage? How do you handle, like, what's the secret there? Right. Yeah. yeah, so let's get started. Yeah, sure. Can you tell me a bit about yourself? What do you do right now? Okay, uh, right now, so I work in a building by the name of uh, One Vendor Building, uh, One Yeah, mm -hmm. and I work over here at uh, the club, Jackson mm -hmm. Park, and uh, I have a sign, uh -huh. yeah. which is a company like that. And I tell everybody that I have a project in Australia yeah. because the fourth one, you know, is when I go back to my living room. Right. Um, and, uh, and there's uh, and I'm telling people that the toughest one. Toughest being one. with her? Yeah, 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 yeah. The toughest <laughs> one, yeah. Because when I go home, because when I go home every day, I have to uh, think her and pay attention to her. Yeah, yeah. And that's like you, know, everybody might know that the ladies you know they ask for uh, many things, you know, like. Uh, uh, they want attention and everything. They so, want attention. So I have to go and I have to go for that, you know. So, uh -huh. so because of that, you know, and uh, I understand everything what you've been saying. Yeah. I've been knowing because the Holy Spirit will talk you know, from the ladies to the woman, uh -huh. the men. And the men have to know what he's saying. That, uh, uh, because everything what the woman says, you know, is true. When she speaks, you know, to the men. And the men have to come. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to be smart enough. Mm -hmm. to, Oh, that what the lady, what the woman said, and uh -huh. you have to uh, be flexible. Mm -hmm. My lady, anything what she asks, I give it to her. I give it to her because that's how they're supposed to be. Because the uh, the woman, I think, giving to a man as like a gift, you know, from God, you know, a gift was, for uh, God. Yeah, from God. Yeah, because he was the first you know, miracle that what he had made for the woman. Wow. It was giving it to the man, you know, as like a gift. And do you? Do you? Um, do you have? Previous girlfriend before meeting Yes, I did. Her? Yes, I did. I did. Uh -huh. But uh, and this the one that I've been staying you know, with you know, for the longest. You know, longest yeah, for, for, the longest. for twenty. For plus twenty years. years. Yeah, wow. twenty years. Yeah. So yeah, it was not easy, and it's still not easy. But I, I got used to it because I understand her. You understand because uh, of that, so many years of experience. Yeah, you know, yeah. You get yeah. to know each other. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think is the most fulfilling part of you know any of your job? What do you feel so proud of? Well, uh, well, I'm proud of the people that I'm still working with those jobs from, from, from the deeper into the dry land. Mm -hmm. From a upper, but like, like, you know, from when you on the upper sea, like, you know, when you far away, mm -hmm. and you can, when you hit the, the dry land, mm -hmm. it's the hardest one. So, right now, every time I'm going to think about that, you know, so I force myself you know, to get her, get her, mm -hmm. as like a family of mine. I got a daughter when I was 13 years old. So 30 years. 13 years old. 13, 13. Yes, 13 years old. So my my mind, my my mind to first, you know, is to take them there to the dry land. Where's the dry land? Dry land need to say like you no, know, like when you are far away on the sea, mm -hmm. you you can be in trouble. So you gotta mm -hmm. be you know how to get to, to make the dry them safe. Yeah, in a, a so safe exactly, environment. Ex exactly, exactly. Uh, exactly. So your your motivation for life is mostly for your family. Yeah. For your wife, for your daughter, you want to provide them what they need. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In the other, in the other, in the other words, like you know, what I was trying to say, you know, in Opa C. Opa C Opa mean, yeah, Opa C means to say meaning that you far away on the sea, mm -hmm. far away on the sea, on the sea. Like when you're in the boat, far away, you have enough sea, you know, the land where you're going, mm -hmm. like that. So okay. when you when stable, the, you want them to be in a stable environment. Yeah, safe. yeah, in a safe place, in a safe, safe, place. safe, safe environment. Mm -hmm. Because you no, know, when a when a boat, you no. Know, Navigating, you know, in the upper sea, mm -hmm. you don't see nothing but darkness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, darkness. Okay. So, yeah. So, like, so, like, when you start seeing the land, everybody gets happy. Mm -hmm. That's a very interesting yeah. analogy. See? Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? So, yes. so that's you know, what each human person should have in their mind, mm -hmm. and to have that and no matter what, because mm -hmm. all the women have the original, yeah. the way, the way that you know they have how they are, and all of them will be. They, they got the same way, and you know, and so you have to understand that not to be jumping from woman to another one because you're going to get the same thing. So, where did you learn this? How did you 
Yeah, because you know, through the through the way that you know, there are being like uh, more in your life, you know, and to when I went to my age, you know, so I had to give it a limit and to give it a stop and to say, okay, this is it, you know. So I got to be not being serious, but I got to be stable. Stable. I got, yeah, I got to be in one place and be strong, and you know, because if you are me, and what I'm doing, what I'm, what is my purpose, you know. Uh, it's not good for me. It will not be good for them too. Uh, for my, uh, for my family. Mm-hmm. So this is this is what each one, each person to have in their mind. Mm-hmm. And always, you know, treating the woman right. Not necessarily you to treat them nice, but you know, you to be aware of you know, what they're asking for. Whatever, anything what they're asking for, give it to them. They ask for yeah, 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 yeah. Give it to them. Yeah, yeah. Because that, this is that, that's where that's where the secret is. To, to give it. How do you know when you meet your wife, this is the person I want to live for a long time? How do you know compared to all other women you've met? Okay, your okay, uh, right. uh, one thing, okay, you know the knowledge of the woman. Knowledge of the woman. The knowledge of the woman. Uh, because in a lot of ways, you know, she might be, she might be afraid of you, she might be experienced, and that uh, men can probably take you, and some men can just go for knowledge of you. My wife is very smart. Smart. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So it's the, the yeah. wisdom. That oh yes. Oh yes. Yes. And that's different. Yeah. Different. Yeah. Yeah. Different. You know than uh, each other person. You know another other woman. But but each woman have that wisdom. Each woman have that same wisdom. Mm. Yes. You just have to. You just have to. You just have to give her the chance. Mm. And you know because to her you will make it. To her. And so you know this is the right person because she's smart yeah. and then later in the life it proved you guys are a good couple yeah. because what you you know achieved whether buying house mm-hmm. building the security for the family yeah. because you love her more and more yeah. as you know more about her yeah. that's kind of one of the key why this relationship is lasting for a long time yeah. well the trust that you know that, you know, that uh, you have trust. as like a man mm-hmm. and your lady because one time we are going to see a counselor and the counselor told me, Eric, do you uh, think that you have a future with this lady? Counselor? Yeah. Marriage counselor? Yeah. Oh, okay. I went to see her and then she asked me uh-huh. on the side, Eric, do you think that you have a future with this lady? I told her, yes, because I'm, I'm the one, I know more than she knows. When, when do you have to go see her? That's what? Long time. Long time. For, for, like about, for I mean, conflict? Like, when we are studying. Yeah, because when you study in a, in a, in a, in a, in a uh, what do you call it? When you started like you know getting together, uh-huh. that's the toughest. One. That's the mm-hmm. toughest time mm-hmm. because you started. Once you go past that, you know, that's seven years, eight years, nine years, ten years, eleven, thirty years, you're going good. But it's every, seven years every very relationship, hard. yeah, 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 yeah. Seven years, yeah, so yeah, hard. yeah, yeah, yeah. Because every relationship, you know, have a have a problem. Every, every, every one, every relationship. Uh-huh. Yeah, and that's and that's when when they started. When they started, they started, they started. It's the problem. So mm. one, yeah. So it goes on, it goes on, it goes on. When you trespass on that, you know. So then you know, it's over. 